Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a small demo on the Brother Scan and Cut DX. The model of my machine is it's the SDX85M and she is in the color Maui. I did pick her up a couple weeks ago and uh, I just had some time to play with it. I did take out all the uh, packaging and all that stuff that comes uh, in the machine. Uh, the blade was housed in here on uh, this little pouch. And the compartments on these are really good size. They're pretty deep. Uh, you do get two. This one's the biggest one and it's a really, really good size. So great for uh, storing all your uh, scraps, like vinyl scraps or other tools that you have. I did put the blade on here. Let me show you how it goes just in case you guys are curious. Uh, this is the blade and this is an auto blade so you don't need to do any adjustment on your materials. Um, there was a little cap on there I did take off and all you do is put it in your housing like that and then just put that down. Uh, there's a little screen right there. Uh, it's saying that there's an update available which I will probably do later. And uh, I did uh, download the Canvas workspace on my computer so I can um, scan the images on here and send them to my canvas workspace so I can do more editing on there. I still have a lot to learn from this um, uh, workspace, the canvas workspace. Uh, I, I have only worked with the Silhouette Studio so uh, we'll see how this goes. But yeah, this is, uh, they give you some projects. So they do have a store just like Cricut and the Silhouette where you can buy some projects. Um, so I already have my mat uh, here with my paper. I did use 110 pound cardstock, which I think I need the um, the uh, stronger adhesive mat. Uh, this is the standard tack at adhesive mat, um, and it seems to kind of like uh, lift a little bit. And but I think it's because of the cardstock. Uh, if it's too thin, I did get a piece of paper, it was kind of stuck in there, so I don't know, I kind of like don't like the mat as much as I would want to, so I don't know, we'll see. I just, you know, I just barely started using it, so I shouldn't talk any, any bad about it, so we'll see. So I got it on here, my prints are from AZ Digitals, and this is a garden party from Maggie Holmes, and uh, I did... Uh, make the smaller on my silhouette app on my silhouette studio I'm sorry and uh, just send it through my printer and so let's see how this works out um, so let me transfer it over here to my my machine and make sure you give your machine some space in the back just because the mat is a little big uh, it's a little bigger than the 12 by 12 it's longer too so let's go ahead and uh, load our mat okay oh and here's some little tools that he came with I forgot to show you those okay so let's go ahead and go over here hope there's not a big glare and that I can do this with one hand so let's do scan and then we're gonna do direct cut the scan to cut data I think it's when you save it to your um, canvas workspace uh, there is so they have um, a Canvas workspace where you can download to your computer you can use offline and they do have an online one as well. So let's do direct cut for now so get started. We are using our machine. We're not going to transfer anything to our computer. So let's press start so you can scan. And uh, we'll see how this does. Okay, so it's scanning our images and hopefully my paper will stay on here you guys because it is really thick paper okay so there's our images uh, sorry about the glare I hope you guys can see the little images on there they're scanned so we're gonna press OK and then we're gonna make this smaller just so it has it's not that big uh, a workspace 
And as you can see, it already outlined some of those images. So let's press preview. And we'll see. That looks fine to me. And then uh, we get to this area here that I found out that that little uh, icon there gives you an outline. You can do an outline distance. So I, I like the 0 0.4. So it gives it a nice little outline. And then we'll press OK. And then OK again. And then it's going to say to please select. So you're going to select what you're doing, either cut or draw, emboss, foil. And there's other features on there as well. So there it is. Let's press start. And let's uh, see how it does. There's our blade working. I like how quiet it is. It's not that loud. And I still have to play with other images. Um, I know there's some uh, images that are more like I can uh, scan differently. Di differently, I'm sorry. And uh, so there's still a lot to um, to discover in this uh, software and the machine itself. And like I said, the images are from AZ Digitals. Okay, so there it is cutting. So we're going to press OK. And I need to get rid of the beeping sound. And then we're going to press unload. And if you unload, you lose whatever images you have on there. So you press OK. Okay, so let's go over here. And let's see how this did. So you see the outline? Okay, let me take this off. I'm working with one hand, you guys, so I'm sorry. I'll just tear my paper there. Hold on. So, I mean, it kind of adhered really good to my mat. So I'm trying to, like, take it off. I don't know. I think I need to get, like, better cardstock because this one... I kind of don't like it. I can't remember why I picked that up. Okay, so there's a little pieces right there. And you see the outline I was talking to you guys about? You can, a lot of people like just being right on the image. But I like that little outline. Let me get um, my little spatula here. See if I can remove these without ripping the paper. So here's a little ticket. And you can make stickers and all kinds of stuff with this. Um, there's a little bow. So cute. Okay, so there's that. Get the little flower. And you can give it uh, a bigger outline if you want. But I kind of like that uh, outline on this images right here. Let's see if I can do this with my finger. Okay. Without ripping. So... So far, it did great, but like I said, I have to uh, play around with it, like with other images, uh, my stamped images, so that's really neat. Okay, so I don't know what else um, I need to tell you about this, but um, hopefully I'll bring more tutorials um, on this machine and on the software as I, as I learn more. I'm new to the uh, Brother Scan and Cut. I have heard lots of good things about it, so we'll see. Okay, so there's my little tiny ephemera that I print, scan and cut on the Brother SDX85M. So hopefully, like I said, I'll bring you guys more videos on this um, and we'll learn together. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Bye.